Kara is with us in Lexington, Kentucky. Hi, Kara. How are you? I'm well, and yourself? Better than I deserve. What's up? Great. Um, quick question. My husband and I, we have about $75,000 in student loan debts combined. Mm -hmm. We have an income roughly of seventy five to 80000 mm -hmm. a year. Mm -hmm. And uh, we have paid off um, a bunch of our little small debts, medical bills, and then my car. And the only other debt that we have is his car, and we owe about 11000 on it. Mm -hmm. We just want to get all this knocked out as soon as possible, and it's kind of overwhelming with such large numbers. The small debts were easy, but the mm -hmm. bigger ones are kind of overwhelming to us. Well, yeah, the debt snowball slows down to a screeching halt once you get past the little ones, right? And so yeah. we're still going to list them smallest to largest, and we're still going to chunk away on it. And then I just start backing off. I kind of pan out and look at the scene a little bit wider, and that helps you have a little bit more hope. So you make 75000 you have $86,000 in debt. If you're going to do it in two years, it'd be forty three a year. That's probably not quite going to happen. Right. Probably going to take you closer to three years. Yeah, we were wanting to do three years or less. And, okay. But also on top of that, I am um, I just applied, and hopefully I will be able to do it, to um, teach children in China English. So uh, that will be an extra income uh, for, for me. Probably maybe up to 600 a month. Done remotely, I take it? Yeah, yes, absolutely. Okay. All right. Sure. Okay, great. Anything we can do. But, you know, basically what we're saying is about three grand a month towards uh -huh. this debt chunks it off. So the car debt is how much? Um, Eleven. About 11000 Yeah, so three grand goes into 11 how many times? Four months, well, you're done. Right. Okay. And, and then so you're that, done. That would and, be good, but we also have money. We have about $15,000 saved up right now. Oh, so we'll pay off the car we, today. Can we just go ahead and pay that off? Yeah, pay off the car today. Baby step one's $1,000. Anything above $1,000 starts going towards his debts. Okay. Are you on and a written budget yet? Like, I'm sorry? Are you doing a written budget yet? Um, we just started, like, back in April trying to do, like, a, we were doing the budget of how much we spend and how much we bring in, and so we're kind of getting a better idea of what, where our money's going, but it's still... It is overwhelming. We just we don't yeah. know if we're doing it right or not. <laughs> You're not doing it right. I can tell by the way you said that. Yeah. <laughs> you, I kind of want to sort of get a feeling of where I'm at. No, that's not how budget works. That, it's not kind of sort of feeling. It's you write it down, you know exactly what you're going to spend on every category, and then you stick to it. And you and your husband, pinky swear and spit shake, this is the freaking plan. Right. So jump on, jump on that. every we dollar. Just, jump on every dollar and download the Every Dollar app tonight. You and your husband go build a real budget. And a budget is yeah. you tell your money what to do. Every dollar has a name. Every dollar has an assignment before the month begins every month. And then you stick okay. to that. And you stay okay. out of a restaurant. You don't need to be inside a restaurant unless you're working there. Right. You're broke. Okay. And you right. don't need to be talking about a vacation. You're broke. Yeah, we've already discussed that we don't need to take any vacations or anything like to go out okay. to eat or anything like that. And so, we've already canceled. We had one plan, but we canceled it. Good, good. So what happened is, is that you've taken all the big pieces and you put them in place. And the only step left for you is the fine tuning. And really okay. just take, take two more steps down into the details. Okay. You're still hovering just above the details on your budget, as an example. And then you can mm -hmm. look at it and go, okay, $3,000 a month, boom, car's done in f four months, boom. $3,000 a month, when's the student loan going to be done? Boom. And we're going to be done with the whole thing, 86000 bucks, which is eleven plus seventy five. That's your student loan plus your car. That, that you know, 3000 a month for 30, or for, um, you know, for 30 months does it, right? That's two and a half years. That's 90 okay, grand. That sounds, that sounds good. So, um... Is there something I need to do with my student loans? To, is I just let them know that the extra is just nope. principal above my regular payment? Nope. Just start file. Yeah, you just put principal only on the payment. Do you, are you right. paying okay. it online? Um, it's well, no. It automatically is deducted from my account every. Okay, month. but see if you have an online ability to pay. Most of the time, they have principal only. I do selection I on do. that on the online page, and you can just say this goes to principal. This goes to principal. You do not want gotcha. to prepay payments. You want to pay principal only payments is what you want to do when you get to your student loan. But right now, the first four months we're on your car, and then we attack from there. So hey, you're doing great.
You got this. You you got this down. You got it. You got the ideas, and you got the play, the big pieces in place. So now let's dive down into the details on this budget tonight. Get this thing laid out. Because what's happened? You kept saying I'm overwhelmed. The reason I know you're not doing your budget is if you had it all laid out in detail, it's not overwhelming. How do you eat an elephant? A bite at a time, and you have a diagram of where to take the first bite. And that diagram is called a budget. Every dollar has an assignment. That's my diagram on eating this elephant. It's an $86,000 elephant that's going to take 30 months. You can do it. This is doable. And um, and you got this extra income. you got all this other stuff going on. It may even happen faster than that for you. Probably will, actually. But we know we can do it in 30, so it's not overwhelming. Great job. Proud of you.